I have a letter from Monica Stonier that I would like to address to you this evening. Dear Evergreen School Board, thank you for your service to our students and community. Thank you for leading the challenging work in a large district with, when state funding is lacking and constricted. I have been a teacher and instructional coach here at Evergreen for 16 years and have been proud of the bold steps EPS has taken to best serve our kids. From full day kindergarten before it was mandated by the legislature to making significant cuts at the district level in order to protect the classroom when the economy took a downturn. Not all teachers have the opportunity to see the operations at the district level that I have, so I share frequently. However, we face enduring challenges. Our most vulnerable students in our community are those who are facing increasing and compounding challenges of poverty. They are facing homelessness, substance abuse in the home, lack of access to health care and mental health services, and rarely come to the educational system with advocates or the ability to self-advocate. Partnering with educators in the bargaining process will allow us all to better serve our students with counselors who are equipped to meet the demands of students. Every week, our sub shortage results in teachers losing their planning time to cover classes. We expect and are willing to support one another when challenges arise, but losing planning time several days in a week happens time after time and is now more the norm than the exception. As an instructional coach, I know the importance of meaningful planning time. This is how we prepare for diverse needs, access progress, and make connections with colleagues and families on behalf of kids. This is when we collaborate, which has been a focus of our professional development time and budget in this district. We are going backwards because our planning time is not protected. Engaging our bargaining process to support teachers in their right to take care of themselves and their families when they are sick with less impact on other teachers' planning time would result in a better return on our investments in the district. Make no mistake, I understand the lack of funding from the state and how that impacts a district like Evergreen. I am sensitive to situations when the frustrations we face as teachers are misplaced at the district level, when the failure of the legislature to fund our schools will continue to be a problem until we elect lawmakers who are committed to that goal. I am working on that in my own way so that you will have a partner in the future. However, right now our district can also partner with educators in the bargaining process to address some of the challenges we face when working hard to deliver the best possible instructions and learning experiences to our students. When time and resources are scarce, we are forced to prioritize and evaluate our values. I am writing to ask you to encourage district leadership to partner with EEA members in bargaining so that we can best serve our shared priority, our students. Monica Stonier, Pacific Middle School Instructional Coach, candidate for Washington House of Representatives, District 49.